There's so much goal setting advice that I'm not going to be able to fit into a very short video. But if there was one thing without the voice crack that I could definitely recommend to you guys is that if you are new to personal development, if you are new to reaching for the stars, if you're new to trying to make these changes in your life, when you start setting your goals, you are going to massively underestimate yourself. It's not a harsh thing to say. That's me telling you that that is the natural instinct of everybody. To set goals that we maybe can just reach. Maybe they're a shelf higher. Maybe we need to get a little teeny step stool. But not literally setting goals that are so far above and beyond that we need to grow massively as a person to actually get there. Just goals that we can see ourselves actually achieving. Um, there's a big misconception, in my opinion, that if you set goals that are achievable, well, it means that when I achieve them, David, it means that that will motivate me to then go on to achieve the next goal that is achievable and the next and the next and that that will build a massive drive within me now everyone's different so i'm not going to say that this isn't a hundred like this is a hundred percent incorrect but for me and for a lot of people that i work with that's not the case it's actually the exact opposite if you've got goals that are achievable if you've got goals that are so easy to achieve the actual fact is many a time people won't achieve them just for the simple fact that they don't get excited by them they don't feel the drive to achieve something bigger they don't feel the challenge to achieve something better than the last goal now i'm actually currently reading a book by grant cardone read it before but it's called 10x if you haven't ever read this book maybe think about adding it to your uh, Christmas list. It's very informative. Grant is very opinionated, but the concepts of this book absolutely blow my mind away. And it fully aligns with my beliefs as far as goal setting is concerned. And again, if you guys are trying to set yourself goals that if you look at yourself and honestly say that your goals aren't above and beyond what you can reach at this date, then I definitely recommend you read this book and definitely, definitely keep watching out for my videos because at the moment, I'm going to be pretty, pretty keen on trying to make sure that you guys for the next six months of this year are going to be reaching for them stars and making sure that you guys are not settling for less. So if you enjoyed this insight, Please make sure you uh, click the like button. Make sure you leave any comments below of any kind of goals that you've set in the past that maybe you actually haven't completed because they haven't been big enough. And make sure you subscribe for the next video, guys. So until then, that's all for today. Have a good rest of the week and bye for now.